Hi, I'm Des Gosling and this is the Overring accelerator and brake system which uh, is quite a popular product that we fit for people. Uh, means you don't have to drive with your legs, you can drive with your hands. Acceleration is done with this ring here and it's an electronic accelerator so there's very little effort required to do the accelerating on the car. The ring is uh, pressed forward like this to do the accelerator and the brake is pushed down to do the braking, very simple there. And uh, the ring, if you want to, you can take this off, there's a button on the top here. Press that button and the whole thing can come off so that if you've got a second driver who doesn't drive with accelerators then they've just got the standard steering there, um, much less in your way. So, Let's just show you how this works. That slots into here. It is simple. It slots onto there. And so that's ready to go. Key in the ignition. Turn it on. On this car you've got to press the brake to, um, to turn the engine on. And so now we're up and ready to go. When we press the ring you'll see that that's not working until we initialise the system. So to initialise it Press the brakes once and it's not working because I've not turned it on. <laughs> so to turn it on, you turn on the power with this switch here. Uh, we've got two switches, one for on for the ring and one which is for 50%. This button here restricts the accelerator to 50% so that if you're learning to drive with it or you're in a tight situation or you're in town or whatever and you don't want as much throttle if it's very powerful engine then you can cut it to 50% which makes it a lot easier to poodle about and to get used to this system. So for now though we're going to go on full power so we'll turn that off to so switch the system on press the brakes once and then this now works the accelerator so just a gentle press on that it's very very gentle we'll do the engine you can see the revs climbing here so that's how that works if you want to switch over back to pedals again then you turn the system off and then you're back with pedal operation. Very simple. Let's go for a drive. Okay, so let's go for a drive with the Guido overing. It's not switched on at the moment. Turn on the turn the switch on and press the brake. That initializes the overing. It won't work until you press the brake. Just the once. And then that's the accelerator there. You can't with this one brake and accelerate brake and accelerate at the same time. So if you are accelerating and then you decide to brake, it cuts out the accelerator so that you're not doing both at the same time. So let's uh, let's select a gear and let's go for a little drive. Show you how it works. gentle very easy to push this thing the hard thing when you're learning to do these is, is not push them too hard uh, so you don't go flying off uh, at high speed a bit faster than you'd like to over the speed bump there um, so nice and gentle squeeze and I'll just people along up out of the industrial estate here so you've got two hands on the wheel while you're accelerating. Braking is via this lever here, which is just on your right hand side. Might just press this for brake, and then when you're ready to go, you just squeeze the accelerator, steer at the same time. or anything like that to work, it's wired directly through from 
here through the car, through the system here, into a control unit that's underneath the dashboard that you don't see. And um, you can still drive with the pedals, but to drive with the pedals you have to switch this off and then you can use the pedals. accelerator pedal down using your hand and that can be quite fatiguing if you've got um, weak fingers or weak hands weaker hands uh, or if you've got arthritis in your fingers then this is a really nice and soft thing to push to um, to do the accelerator so it's very gentle there's no fatiguing of the fingers and uh, that's one of its most popular selling points and obviously also quite a few people like these if you've not got um, if you don't like using a, a knob on the wheel so a lot of hand controls you've got a knob which you do all the steering with whereas this you've got two hands to do the steering That's it. It's the Guido Overing. <laughs> 